All right, this is gonna be a good show we got here today. Pay per view time. Let's start this. Nine matches on the card tonight. All titles are on the line. We got three main event matches. So let's kick things off with a YouTube title match. Jack put up an open challenge. And it looks like Luke Kane accepted. Not just any Luke Kane. It's the Fire God version of Luke Kane. The, uh, the one from Mortal Kombat 11. He is taking on the challenge of Jack Septiguy. It's going to be one hell of a pay-per-view here at Overseas Infinity over in Tokyo, Japan. At the, we're at the Tokyo Dome. There are three main events of the evening. A tag Team Titles match. Motor City Machine Guns versus Rhett and Kevin Knight. You got the finals of the championship tournament as it's Sean versus Christopher Daniels. And your main event of the evening, Corey Crichton versus Art the Clown. For the, YouTube, for the World Championship. Welcome here to Tokyo Dome. Here's Luke Kang. Now comes the champion, Jack Septiguy. Belt and line as my controller batteries are low. There's a controller here for just a second. Jack will larry it. Jack Sepkai has been YouTube champion for a little while. He won it back at Battle for the Tropics. And ever since Battle for the Tropics, he has been champion. Including a big triple threat win at our last pay per view to retain the title. Kick out by Luke Oh, well, that's cool. Uh, I didn't actually know that in game Luke Kane's tattoo is glow. That's pretty cool. Jack and Luke Kane now. Yeah. Luke Kane's on the apron. Jack Septiguy throws him right into the ring. Goodness me. The arena, this arena here is based off of the uh, new beginning when New Japan went to the United States. But it's a nice arena, so that's why I figured using it. Nice counter by Luke Kane. Luke Kane from behind. Throws Jack off the ropes. Run to each other. Luke Kane throws Jack. Oh, rip cord knee. Nice knee by Luke Kane. And Luke Kane is feeling it right now. But Jack set the guy the champion. Oh, what a shoulder block by Jack. And here comes Jack set the guy. Nice into arm suplex. Cover from the win to retain, not a kick out. Jack drops the knee. And another cover by the champion. And a kick out by Liu Kang. For another knee, and he missed it. Liu Kang moved out of the way to the ahead of Jack. And Jack got to roll out to the outside, and Liu Kang with that dive on the floor. And a high knee that's gone the floor by, Jack, by uh, Liu Kang. Shot right to the head by Liu Kang. And a stop in the rib cage. Liu Kang throws Jack back into the ring. Sean. And wait. Liu Kang with a discus elbow. That was hellacious, but Jack got right back up from it. I don't know how he got right back up from that. Oh, and there's a knee to the head. Oh, Liu Kang with a kick up. From behind, back. Suplex, oh, with the knee to the spine. Liu Kang's trying to fire it up again. Ooh, nice shot right to the ribs by Jack Sepagai. And that verbal suplex. Jack picking up Luke Kane, trying to end Luke Kane tonight. Irish curse. Flappy enough to retain his title. Oh! Jack 
except I retained the title, but thanks to a referee mishap. Oh, come on, really? Oh. The Jack Seppi guy retains the YouTube title thanks to a referee mishap. It's the first one of 2K23 that I've seen. But it's better to get that stuff out of the way now. The Jack Seppi guy is still the YouTube champion. And stuff, we got a debut here. Corey Wagner with Sean in his corner is going to face Deathstroke. Corey and Sean, of course, part of the number six with cheese on YouTube. So shout outs to both men. Sean is fighting later tonight, of course, in the in one of the three main event matches against Christopher Daniels for the finals of the tournament. The winner will become the first hardcore champion. Sean won saw, uh, group B. Well, Daniels won Group A. And stuff going to be a heck of a marquee matchup in the main event. In one of the three main events. Of course, uh, the other two main events with uh, the tag team tiles on the line with Motor City Machine Guns of Alex Shelley and Chris Saban facing the new team of... Uh, face of the champions, Rhett McLaughlin and his... Uh, and Lance's replacement partner for right now, Kevin Knight. And, and the big... Time final match of the evening. Art the Clown defending that world title against my mentor in MSW, Corey Triton. As let's see, Corey Wagner's debut here. Here's Corey coming out with Sean. Corey versus Sean. I mean, not Corey versus Sean. That'll happen at some point, but it's Corey versus Destro. Corey misses that kick, but Destro with that drop kick to the back. Oh. Shot to Corey's dome by Destro. Destro will stop the arm of Corey. And, oh, shot of the back of Corey. Oh, nice kick by Corey to counter that one. Destro lifting up Corey. Ooh, burning hammer already, but Corey's getting right back up from that. Corey just did one of the most dangerous moves in wrestling, and the burning hammer, he got right back up from it. Oh, but a neck breaker by Destro. And here comes Destro, that striking ability of his really on par tonight. Corey trying to get up, trying to just get back into this fight, but he's getting his arm wrenched into the ropes here by Destro. More kicks and shots from Destro. Lifts up Corey, running power bomb. All Destro right now. Right back of the head of Corey. Corey's got to figure out a way to get back into this. Destro off the ropes. Oh, and he misses the knee drop. Corey moved. And that could be the time that Corey needs to get back into this. Corey, gun wrench, tosses a nice gun wrench. Oh, he flipped over. Corey, second one, rolls through into the cover. And we'll see what's for Corey, but a kick out by Destro. Corey, springboard, kick. Destro trying it up for Corey now in the driver's seat. Corey, oh, he missed. Cover by Destro. And a rope break called there by the referee. Okay, so he can call it during this match, which has nothing on the line with it, but you can't call one during a title match? That's interesting. Whoa, and Corey sent to the floor by Destro. And now we have two men on the outside, but here's Corey. Uh oh, the best stroke. Oh, DDT on the floor to Corey. Corey's head going right off of the con right off of the little bit of the padding that we have on the floor. Ooh, his arm. Hurt on that one. Destro sweeping su oh sleeping a sweeping suplex on the floor. Corey's going to fill that one in the morning. Destro throws Corey back into the ring. 
Corey's down, but he gets right back up. Corey showing no fear. Corey, step up. What a step up by Corey. Corey for the win, not a kick out by Destro. Oh, Destro caught him. Oh my God, you're not even Destro. The beat, Corey. Not a kick out for Corey Wagner. Corey's trying to get up here on the ropes. Destro sends him to the floor. Oh, but Corey caught himself. Oh, Corey caught himself. Nice job by Corey. Oh, bro, Derek by Corey. Oh, is Corey thinking about it? Winner for it, Corey. Sixers punch. A Sixer punch by Corey. And a kick out from Destro off the Sixer punch. Oh, a Sixer punch by Corey, but just not enough to get the job done. Corey. Diving cross body on the floor. Corey is putting his body in all types of interesting situations tonight. He's shown some heart. Oh my goodness, those kicks in the chest. Corey relentless right now. Oh, Destro got up. Destro counters. Referee tell both men get back in. He's battling on the outside. Corey and Destro. Oh, German by Corey on the floor. Destro could be feeling that one in the morning. Seven count, Corey, get your ass back in the ring. Destro picked up by Corey. Corey blocked by Destro. Oh no, brain buster. Oh, brain buster for Corey. And Destro's gonna try to end it. Oh, Jesus. A death sentence by Destro. And oh, Corey kicked out of it. Oh, Destro from out of nowhere. Firing off shots to Corey here. And a Pele kick to Corey. Destro with a death sentence, but somehow Corey's able to kick out another rope break from Corey. Destro telling the referee to stop calling the rope breaks. He didn't do it in the last match. Corey's in trouble. Wait, Corey. Corey countered it. Corey. Step up. Corey just hit that punch again. No, he isn't. Sixers submission. A Sixers submission from Corey. And Destro taps out to Corey. And Corey's just got his first win. A Sixers submission. Corey with Sean, with his buddy Sean in his corner, picks up his first win in the company. Beautiful win by Corey. I mean, he had a, he had to take a lot of punishment to win, but he got the victory nonetheless. And that win by Corey might help Sean out in his uh, match against Christopher Daniels later on the night. But now we had a match between Cartoons and Terminator for the Never Openweight Championship. This match was made due to the fact that uh, Cartoons fought Terminator in a, in a great match two episodes ago. And um, Cartoons beat him. And so Oliver Queen, her owner, who apparently is not here tonight due to the attack from Slenderman, basically set this match up. So we have a backup owner for our... For tonight's episode, due to the fact of the uh, chokehold that Slenderman put on Oliver Queen, so Joe Kenny right now is the owner for tonight, just to oversee things. No, actually, no, it's Matt Bennett. Actually, that's the oversee. That's the over. That's the overlooker, basically, for this pay per view, just to make sure nothing too crazy happens. So here we go. Cartoons versus. Terminator. Terminator has held this championship since Hypnotic Highway. He defeated 
Dr. Dre to win that title. Dre held that thing for a good amount of time, but Terminator got the best of him. We've not seen Dr. Dre ever since he lost that title to Terminator. Let's find out who's going to walk out of here with that title here in Tokyo. And here we go. Terminator used his power early on on cartoons. <coughs> oh, just drop him. I might have another stream later on today. If we don't have one later on today, we'll have one tomorrow morning. Terminator from behind. Oh, oh. Oh my goodness, flips him over, going to like a, a version of like a cross face or some type of block. Paratude's not like that one one bit. <sighs> Big yard. Oh, this is dangerous. We're starting off with this already. Oh my god, a DDT. So I might want to check on Terminator's head. This is no holds bar, so anything goes. There are no rules in this match. The only thing is you uh, get your pinfall or submission. Whoa, and or outside the rate, he will. Let me rephrase that, I can't speak. You have to get your pinfall or submission inside the ring, but there's no rules. So that means you can use any weapon you want to fight in or out of the ring. Uppercut. These two in the crowd right now. Oh! Jeez, what a punch by the Terminator. Another uppercut from the Terminator. And the champion in Cartoons now. Cartoons fighting back. crowd out here on the left side of the barricade, a heck of a show. Now both men are going out here, back outside the ring. Oh, right into the steps, basically, that are right on the outside. Cartoons and Terminator. Now out here near where the entrance ramp is, oh, and Terminator's shoulder driven right into the barricade. We're getting closer and closer to the all-concrete floor, and again, Terminator's shoulder right into the barricade. Terminator thrown back in the rain. Cartoons could be trying to end it already. And he's waiting for Terminator to get up. And he picks him up. The kick. So it's a flip. Nice. Might be enough. No, Terminator. Remember, it's a rolling stunner that won cartoons of the match when they first had a match against each other. Always oh, he think about something else? Oh, but Terminator got a great counter in. I think cartoons was thinking the cartoon effect, but a beautiful oh, counter by Terminator. What a shot. Oh. Cartoons trying to get it, just trying to get up. Terminator. Terminator. Oh my goodness, he kicked him on the side of the head. That could be enough maybe to retain in cartoons at two. Terminator thought he had this thing won with that kick to the side of the head, but it was not enough. Oh, that could be enough of running power slam. Oh, the cartoons with the kick up. Cartoons, airplane spin. Big, oh my goodness. A big yawn again. Cartoon is just spinning around the Terminator. Oh. Welcome back to the feet. Wait a second. Octopus hold. An octopus hold out of nowhere. It's not expected to see an octopus hold by the cartoons tonight. Terminator trying to fight it, trying to get out of it. Ooh, just, just dropped a hold of the leg. Oh, running neck breaker. Oh. 
Oh, he's got the arm. Oh, he's got the arm. Oh, back suplex right to the arm of Cartoon. And more power shown off by the Terminator with a power ball. That could be the end of the fight, maybe. Now Cartoon's again at two and a half. Terminator wondering what's it going to take to beat Cartoons. Did a lot in their first match beat Terminator. Oh, what a kick. Cartoon springboard. Oh! Springboard cutter. That could be enough. No one a kick out. Cartoons can't believe it. Well, he's got to start believing. That's what he's got to do. Oh, now he's going to get the other steel steps. Oh, Ter Terminator kicked him. Oh, no. 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 No, this is dangerous. Oh, a power bomb the barricade. Oh, Jesus. He whipped him right into the steps that were placed right near the apron of the ring. Oh. Oh, no. Damage to the head, is that gonna do the cartoons? Oh my god. Ooh, kick to the head. Cartoon's trying to get some, I think he's trying to get some feeling back in his head after he got like, completely whipped right into the steel steps on the floor. <laughs> Terminator's uh, flexing for some reason. I don't know why he needs to flex for. There's no reason to. Oh. Terminator. Oh! Cartoon's right to the barricade on the floor. Now he's back in the ring. Terminator trying to get back in as well. <clears throat> oh, Cartoon's caught him! Cartoon's caught him with that sunset clip! That might do it enough right there! No! Oh, sunset flip out of nowhere. Cartoons. Yeah. Off the ropes goes Terminator. Rolling stutter. Not be enough to crown a new champion off that rolling stutter. Yes. We got a new never open weight champion. Rolling stunner by Cartoons for the win, and he is now the new Never Open Weight Champion. Terminator never was able to hit any of that choke toss or any of those elbows. Cartoons capitalizes off a surprise sunset flip to hit the rolling stunner and to win the Never Open Weight title. What a win for him. Next up. John Moxley versus Kenta. Two rivals get their rivalry renewed for one match here tonight. If you've never seen New Japan, well, John Moxley at one point was the IWGP United States Champion. Kenta had the briefcase, which he cashed in for, which to be cashed in for a shot against John Moxley. And those two had a little bit of a back and forth feud for that United States title, even though John Moxley was able to retain against Kenta. I'm very bad to start to get a drink of something. I'll do some shout outs later on. After this match is over and that's match before the next match starts, I'll do some shout outs. After this, we got a lot of championship matches. So here we go, Moxley versus Kenta. Let's see if anything has changed between these two men since they last fought. Kenta throws Moxley off the ropes. Kenta, oh my God, what a shot in the ribs of John Moxley. Kenta, what a shot in the forearm. Kenta. Kenton's definitely going to have the uh, striking advantage over John Moxley. 
Cover, and a kick out from Moxley. Both men are a part of a faction in wrestling. Moxley's a part of the Blackpool Combat Club, and Kent is a part of Bullet Club. Moxley throws Kenta over the top to the floor. Moxley's gonna follow suit to Kenta on the outside. Moxley blocked by Kenta, but he caught him. Oh, Tiger suplex on the floor by John Moxley. Kenta, oh, knees right to the ribs of John Moxley. Last episode, John Moxley and James A. Denise teamed together to face Kenta and Hiromu Takahashi. And Hiromu got the time bomb on Moxley, get that win. What a kick to the head of Moxley by Kenta that was. So last episode, Hiromu Takahashi pinned John Moxley off of the time bomb. And it looks like tonight, Kenta won at Moxley, and Kenta got his wish. Right now, Kenta's in control. Caught by Moxley. Moxley, nice. Crowd's really into this match tonight. And you see why these two are both guys that fought for New Japan before. Oh, running boot in the corner from Kenta to John Moxley. Oh my god. Oh, what a name by Kenta. Cover and a kick out from Moxley. Kick up from John. Here comes Moxley, fight back. Moxley, another straight board. Back to his feet. Moxley, another straight board. Kenta back to his feet. Moxley, I think he was thinking paradigm shift, but he didn't get it time. Kenta with that knee to the ribs and a kick to the side of the head. Beauty combo by Kenta. Here comes Moxley. Moxley. Nice arm drag to Kenta. John Moxley going up top. Be dangerous here. John Moxley will die. Over here to Kenta. Oh, a kick out one from Kenta. Moxley lifting him up. Running. Power slam from John Moxley. Lapping up. Kick out. Moxley, is he thinking about it? Is he thinking Death Rider? Is he thinking about the Death Rider? Kenta blocks that strike by Moxley. Kenta throws Mox in the corner. Who kicks him right in the ribs. And a running drop kick to the corner from Kenta. Kenta to beat Moxley. No, and a kick out from John. And a kick to the back. Kenta. Could he be thinking about it, maybe? Kenta, top rope. Diving double foot stomp by Kenta to John Moxley. Might be enough for Kenta to beat Moxley. Yes! Kenta has defeated John Moxley. He's gotten payback for, for a few years ago. So Kenta defeating John Moxley here tonight. Getting revenge. And now the rest of our matches tonight are title matches. So our next match of the evening, Jeff the Killer has to defend his Mortal Kombat Championship against Adrian Coleman in a ladder match. These two have been having a feud ever s for a long time, and tonight could very well blow off here in this ladder match. All right, shout-outs. Usual shout-outs. We're going to start first. Vampiro712, we'll probably have WC, uh, ECW later tonight. Uh, Shockwave Wrestling, Prince Macau, Dust Tiller 30, Iron Taylor, Franchise Gaming, and Number 6 with Cheese. Random shoutouts, uh, John Wood 4, I'll be seeing that Thursday night. Uh, MOB, because opening day is tomorrow, we'll be watching a lot of games tomorrow. And uh, Water. Water gets the last shout out because it's water. So here we go. Ladder match time for the Mortal Kombat title. 
currently held by Jeff the Killer, even though uh, Coleman stole the championship from him, and he's claiming himself to be the champion. So here we go. Let's see who's going to. Oh, sorry. Hit pause there. Let's see who's going to win the title tonight. Oh, what a nap breaker from Jeff. Jeff saying, eat my dust. And Jeff thrown to the apron by Coleman. Coleman wearing some uh, red and white today. Interesting. Oh, Coleman forearm shot. Oh, no. Oh, just a slingshot. DDT right to the apron by Adrian Coleman. And Coleman's going to grab a ladder. Not before uh, Jeff to have something to say about it. Oh, for DDT to the floor. Kick by Jeff. Ah, psycho cutter on the floor by Jeff. Jeff from behind with a lariat. These two absolutely hate each other. They've been going at it like, well, for God knows how long. Oh, Jeff with the ladder. Jeff with that ladder right to Coleman. Jeff has the ladder again. But Coleman says, no, it's my ladder. Oh, rip for knee. Coleman throws Jeff to the floor, and Adrian Coleman's got the ring to himself right now. And he's going to grab the ladder. And so is Jeff. Jeff's grabbing the ladder, but he's bridging it across the announce table. Well, that gives Adrian Coleman time to go grab the title. Adrian Coleman's got the championship. Can he unhook it? Oh, no. Coleman trying to unhook the title here. Oh, and here we go. We got a battle up here at the top of the ladder. Coleman blocked. Oh, the head of Jeff off the top of the ladder. Oh, and again. Blocked by Jeff. Jeff tosses Coleman from the top of the ladder. Jeff, can he just get up there and grab his title? Can he get, unhook his title? Oh, no, and Coleman pushes the ladder off. Oh my god, Coleman power bombing Jeff right to the ladder. I don't know if you want to put it there, Coleman. You're right near the other the bridge the ladder. Coleman trying to grab the title. Coleman's trying to grab the title. He's got his hands on it. All he has to do is just somehow get a piece of it. Adrian Coleman. Oh my god, Adrian Coleman has just won the title. Adrian Coleman has won it. Adrian Coleman has just unhooked the title. So now he can pro properly say that he's the Mortal Kombat champion. Next up on the card. Moon Knight versus Freddy Krueger for Freddy's Infinity Championship. After this is the big three matches. This show's going a lot faster than what I thought it would be, which is very interesting. I thought that ladder match would take a longer time, but I guess not. I guess that just means the big three matches will be longer. It's very bad. Start to grab another drink. Before each of the bid three matches, we're going to have an interview backstage. Clark Kenzie talks to the mainly the challengers or or the champion, depending on whoever just comes up with the interview first. All right, so this match is set up because Moon Knight defeated Freddy Krueger on the first episode of 2K23 for Thursday Night's Warfare, and uh, Freddy ended up giving him the shot, but Freddy Krueger. One hell of a champion since he has that title. This is the second time he's hold this championship. And see, let's find out if Freddy Krueger can keep a hold of this belt against Moon Knight here in Japan. Freddy throws him onto the apron here. Freddy Krueger shot to 
Moon Knight. A couple more shots of the apron of Moon Knight by Kruger. Freddy top rope. And Freddy with that diamond ass hand on the floor. Freddy throws him back in the ring. Freddy's, Freddy's looking very determined. He wants to win that title, or should I say retain it? Moon Knight went for a dive and he missed. Freddy, oh, what a Larry already by Freddy Krueger. Stomping away at the chest of Moon Knight is Freddy. Covered by Krueger for the win. And a kick out by Moon Knight. Krueger, oh, right to the spine of Moon Knight here with a, with a bear hug. Ooh. Ooh, shot of the back and clocked him one in the ears. So far tonight, two, championship, two championships have changed hands in the Never Open Way and Mortal Kombat Championships. Jack Sepperdy is the only one to retain his title so far, and that was off due to a referee mishap. What Freddy was doing right there. Moon Knight from behind. Oh, knee to the back. Moon Knight. We're on some punches to Freddy Krueger. Knight as Kruger picks him up. Oh, big fireman's carry gut buster to Freddy Kruger. And he's, oh, Freddy thrown back in the ring. Freddy, kick by Moon Knight. Another counter this time by Kruger. Oh! Now Freddy taunting Moon Knight, but Moon Knight's going for a springboard cross body. Covered by Moon Knight to win the title. Kick out by Freddy. Head scissors here by Moon Knight with some elbows. Moon Knight maybe hit a crescent kick or something like that. Nice snap breaker from Moon Knight. Well, Moon Knight has to do some, probably some big moves and he's champion. He's beaten Freddy before, he can definitely do it again. It's like what cartoons did against Terminator earlier. Oh, he's setting up for it. The present kick. No. Nope. Freddy's getting up too fast. Good punches here to Freddy Krueger. Freddy, though, blocking him. Freddy caught him. Oh, version of a choke slam by Freddy Krueger. Krueger to win for Tay. No, a kick out by Moon Knight. Look out here. Courtesy of Freddy Krueger. And Freddy stalking his prey, but here's Moon Knight. You can take your eyes off Moon Knight. Ooh, knee right to the back of Freddy Krueger again. Freddy trying it up. Freddy. Oh my goodness, a power bomb on the floor by Moon Knight to Freddy, and Freddy counters Moon A well, five count. I don't know. I don't think we want to see a count out here, especially with a championship on the line. Six count. Uh oh. Moon Knight has Freddy Krueger. Nice Michinoku driver. Seven. Hurry up, you two. Get back in the rain. I don't think the fans want to see a count out here. Well, maybe Freddy is. Oh, what a jumping neck breaker on the floor by Freddy Krueger. And a nine count, and both men are back in the ring. That could have been very dangerous for both men. Ooh. Here's Freddy Krueger again on offense. Freddy, what a shot with that clawed hand. Oh, Freddy trying to end up that claw, but Moon Knight blocked it. Oh, super kick, and a straight jacket German suplex. Freddy's down. This could be the opportunity that Moon Knight wants. He's covering. He's going for the cover. Not a kick out by Freddy Krueger. Freddy's in trouble big time. Moon Knight. Oh, he's thinking about that stomp. Oh, and he missed. Moon Knight missed in the corner. Freddy, choke slam. Freddy Krueger with a choke slam. Moon Knight went for that 
for him in the corner, which sets up that curve stomp. But Freddie caught him. Nightmare slam. Nightmare slam by Freddy Krueger. And that could very well spell the end of this match. And Moon Knight somehow got the kick out. And Freddy's beside himself. He thought he had Moon Knight beat. He thought he had him done. But Moon Knight kicked out. Moon Knight took caution to the wind as he went for that stomp in the corner. Freddy countered it. And Freddy hit a choke slam and then the nightmare slam. But it was just not enough to put away Moon Knight. Oh, but here's Freddy. Moon Knight blocking it. The fans want Moon Knight to win. Oh, super kick. And a straight jacket German on the floor. These two, these two are having a hell of a match tonight. And Freddy into the steps. Three here to Freddy. Moon Knight's going up. No, nope. yes he's not, he's just taunting. Moon Knight waiting for Freddy Krueger. Freddy, going to roll back in the ring. Oh, Moon Knight tries set for something, Krueger caught him. Moon Knight, oh, what a shot by Freddy. Freddy though, eats a kick to the head. Is Moon Knight gonna set up for that stomp in the corner? I think he is. Yes, he is, can he hit it this time? He got the, the, the shot, he sets up for it, and he got it. Moon Knight hit the stomp out of the corner. Is that gonna be for a title? Yes, it is. Moon Knight has defeated Freddy Krueger here tonight and he has won the Infinity title. Freddy had opportunities to lock that claw in or hit that Nightmare Slam again. He never decided to go for it, and it costed him as Moon Knight is now your new Infinity Champion. What a win for Moon Knight here in Japan. And now we're big three of the evening. First, World Tag Team Titles are on the line in a tornado tag match. The Motor City Machine Guns, Alex Shelley, Chris Saban, versus Rhett McLaughlin and his new tag team partner, due to his uh, best friend Link being out with surgery to his arm, Kevin Knight, as we're going to roll up that stage for an interview with Rhett and Kevin Knight. So, Clark Kane here backstage with the World Tag Team Champions, Rhett and Kevin Knight, you two facing the Motor City Machine Guns. What do you think about this matchup here? Well, I gotta say this for me and Red here. I might be young. I might have some inexperience against these boys, even though I fought them a few times. But I will say, Rhett, with our combined forces, combined styles, we will retain those tag team titles tonight. You can call on me if you ever need me. Well, thanks there, Kevin. And I will say, the Motor City Machine Guns are one hell of a tag team. They've won titles from all over the world. And they're the current strong open weight tag team champions for, in New Japan. But I do agree with you, Kevin Knight. We will retain those tag team titles. Let's go out of the ring. Well, anyway, let's throw it back out of the ring, I guess, for this match. So, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. First of three big main event matches here in Japan. Here comes Alex Shelley of the Motor City Machine Guns. This is getting ready for this World Tag Team title match. Now, and now following suit is his best friend, Chris Saban. comes the champions. Kevin Knight, one half of the tag team champions. Of course, it was supposed to be Red and Link that are the current tag team champions, but due to Link having surgery on his arm and having, having to deal with some recovery time, Kevin Knight is taking his spot. And I, that's good pick by Red. Kevin Knight is a young dude that can definitely learn a lot from tag team and Red Blocker. And he kind of fits the profile that Link had. He's very athletic. And 
there's the other half of the tag team champions. Brett McLaughlin. So here we go, tag team titles on the line. Motor City Machine Guns versus Brett and Kevin Knight. Let's find out who's going to win these tag team championships. Will the champions retain or will we see new champions? As Chris Saban's going after Kevin Knight and Shelly and Rhett are going at it. And we'll back suplex by Chris Saban. Alex Shelley versus Kevin Knight, and it's saving his Brett. Oh, and a kick out at two by Brett. Almost had two new tag team champions right there. It's like a drop kick there by Alex, by Chris Saban. He's over by Shelley. Oh, cutter by Saban. Cover and a kick out by Kevin Knight. A shot by to Brett there by Saban. Now this is all been Motor City machine guns. Oh, Saban misses. This is the chance that Knight and Brett need to get back into this match. Knight, what a hands, oh, what a move on the floor by Kevin Knight on Alex Shelley. And the young junior heavyweight Kevin Knight is being beaten down here by Shelley. Ooh, sidewalk slam by Brett on Chris Saban. Oh, dangerous version of a neck breaker into the knee there by Kevin Knight. Suplex toss by Brett McLaughlin, the former world champion. Oh, a boot to the head by Kevin Knight on Alex Shelley. Brett soaking in all the crowd here in Japan. This is the second time Brett McLaughlin has fought in Japan. The first time he was world champion, and he ended up facing his best friend Link in the main event, and he ended up beating Link to retain his world title. Now the Motor City Machine Guns trying to double team on Rhett here. Kevin Knight waiting for uh, one of the machine Motor City Machine Guns to get back in the ring here. Rhett and Alex Shelley going at it. This is dangerous here. Oh, really press. Now this double team right to Rhett on the floor. And now we got Knight and Shelley in the ring. Kevin Knight. Using his speed here on a block, they ran to each other. And Kevin Knight with a jumpy DDT. Beauty by Kevin Knight. And a bulldog by Knight. And saving from behind the net break to Red. The crowd here, Knight with another play drop to the arm of Alex Shelley. A press there for Chris Saban by Red McLaughlin. Kevin Knight. What a hellacious dive to the floor of Alex Shelley. Brett will dive the lax hand on the floor. And Brett, oh, missed Shelley. Ooh, a chop off to Brett's leg. Takes out Brett. Here comes Kevin Knight, gonna follow Saban in the rain. Saban caught Knight. Oh! Dominator to a DDT type of deal and a kick out by Kevin Knight. As we almost saw new tag team champions. Saban has Knight right now. Knight off the ropes. Back elbow. Oh no. Top kick by Kevin Knight. And Kevin Knight's going up. Is he thinking for that diving leg draw? He got it, Kevin Knight. Kevin Knight with that diving leg draw. Will that be enough to put away Saban? It is! Kevin Knight gets the pinfall over Chris Saban, and Rhett and, and, Rhett and Kevin Knight have retained the World Tag Team Championships. Kevin Knight proven to Rhett McLaughlin that he can trust him as his tag team partner. Pinning Chris Saban off that diving leg drop from the top rope for the win. It's a hell of a win for uh, Rhett, but an even bigger win for Kevin Knight. Proving that uh, he's got a lot of heart in him and that Rhett can put his trust in him. And now, the second big match of the evening of three. Sean versus Christopher Daniels. The finals of the Hardcore Championship Tournament. Sean's got Corey in his corner for tonight. This is a big match. 
And would you look at that? Slenderman did not get what he wanted. Slenderman wanted to be in this match, but attacking the owner won't help. So if I'm the referee of this match or anyone in the back, I'll keep an eye out for Slenderman just in case if he tries to interfere in this match. And yes, we have my favorite song of all time playing in the background. Thing from you. And all I have last is for the truth. Showed your time when it was faulted to. Venom was lethal. I almost believed you. Some water in here before this match starts. So here we go, the finals of the hardcore title tournament. Sean, the winner of, of Group B. Coming out of the ring with his best friend, Corey Wagner. And YouTube partner, I would say as well, Corey. Corey fought earlier on in the night. And Corey got the win over Deathstroke in a great match. With him walking in the Sixer submission. And Sean is ready for this battle. Yeah, no, he's ready for this fight. It's going to be a great match. Sean beat Charmex and Slenderman to get into the finals of the tournament. Uh, Christopher Daniels here won, so won Group A. He won a fatal four-way in round number one. Round number two, he beat Morbid in a great match. And round number three in the semifinals, he beat the Joker. And so he's here tonight to try to win the Hardcore Championship. And uh, Christopher Daniels' career has been a legendary one. And he can very well add another accomplishment to it tonight. If he beats Sean, that is. It's not going to be easy. These two men are going to be up for a great match. And let's start it. Daniels starting off the offense early. Dropping him down. Daniels, a nice counter of the leg there by Sean. Corey trying to get Sean rallied up in this match. Sean, ripcord with the shoulder block. Cover here by Sean to win the title and a kick out of one by Daniels. Whoa, Sean doing some flips here. But Daniels says, you want, nope, well, no, Sean blocked it. Nice roll through by Daniels. Christopher Daniels. Falcon arrow by Daniels, beautiful. Cover by Christopher Daniels to win the title. And a kick out by Sean. Sean and Daniels are both going to be in for a long night. Nice hurricane runner from Sean. Hit by Sean in the ribs. Sean. Setting up for a brain buster. Sean now in control. German suplex toss. Fans are loving what they're seeing right now from Sean here in Japan. Oh, wrenching with the arm and fingers of Christopher Daniels. Sean throws him in the corner. Corey's liking what he's seen from his buddy Sean so far. Oh, the arm of Daniels right to the ropes. Kick here. Sunset flip off the corner by Sean. Daniels gets up though. Christopher Daniels. This whole tournament, Daniels has shown, has, has shown so much heart. And that's what's gotten Daniels so far to the finals. The question is, will he show even more tonight? What a kick by Sean. Oh, oh, Daniels saw that one coming with the knees. Probably the experience factor playing in there for Christopher Daniels. Sean doesn't have too much experience in the ring, but nice counter by Sean. He's thinking about maybe hitting that Boston Crab, maybe trying to lock it in. Over by Sean. Sean maybe trying to go for a win, but a kick out by Daniels. Daniels getting up to his feet. Sean, knee to the side of the head of Daniels. Thing Sean is going to have to worry about though is maybe the uh, the Slenderman factor. Whoa! Sean went for a dive on the floor. Daniel saw it coming, and so he moved out of the way. Sean landed on his head first on the floor. Oh, what a German by Sean to Daniels. This is that hard hitting factor of the match that I figured we will have. Oh, Fisherman's DDT from Sean on the floor. My God. 
heck of a move by Sean, but Daniel's saying what you can do, I'm going to do different. Oh! Sean, oh, Sean with a chop locks on the leg of Daniels. Rolling kick by Sean. Oh no, eight count. These two are going to back in the ring. And Sean breaking that count. Smart move by Sean. I don't think the fans want to see a count out in this match. Another Fisherman's DDT. Referee trying to help both men get the hell in the ring. Sean get back in the ring following the ref's orders. Sean then he's Brock Lesnar for some reason. Four count to Daniels. Sean says get back to the ring Daniels and so he throws him in. Oh Daniels caught Sean. Urinagi for Christopher Daniels. That could very well give him the win. Oh, Sean kicks out at two. Sean kicks up. Oh, Daniels caught Sean again. Angels, wings. Christopher Daniels off Angel Wings. Can he win the championship off Angel Wings? The cover, hook the leg on oh, Sean at two. Sean kicks out of Angels Wings. Christopher Daniels almost won the title off of that. Oh my God. Daniels taking his body at risk with that dive. That missile dropped it to the floor. Uh oh, Sean's grabbing his leg. That could be bad for Sean. Daniels firing off on the outside. Oh, side suplex to Sean on the floor. Sean now grabbing at his neck. Now Daniels conning. Refer Sean might want to get up. Sean might be out cold. Sean might be out. Oh no, he's, oh no, Sean is starting to get back to his feet though. That side suplex did a lot of damage to Sean. And if somehow, some way, Christopher Daniels can pick up a win tonight, it's thanks to that side suplex that he hit on the floor. Daniels, what a DDT! Sean's in big trouble. We might be seeing Christopher Daniels become champion maybe. Oh, Sean blocked it. Daniels, I thought he was thinking for that year not when he got caught. Daniels got kicked in the head. Covered by Sean to win. And a kick out by Christopher Daniels. Here comes Sean. Sean picks up Daniels. And snake eyes for Christopher Daniels. And Sean is on fire. Sean, a dominant stretch. Is Christopher Daniels going to tap out for Sean? Got it locked in. Referee asking him from behind. Oh, oh, shot straight to the head of Sean. Daniels using some athleticism. Oh, kick to the head of Sean. Barely affected him though. Sean's going up to the top rope. Uh oh, six your elbow. Or say the jump cut by Sean. Sean, the jump cut. Oh, and Daniels. Daniels somehow kicked out of the jump cut. How the hell did Daniels kick out of jump cut? Oh, the, oh no, Daniels blocked it. Daniels blocked the Boston Crab. Sean was really beside himself. He thought he was, he, he thought he had the match won. He thought he had the match won off the jump cut, but a kick out by Daniels. That just shows how much heart Christopher Daniels has tonight. Oh, Daniels caught Sean. Oh, spinning back fist. Oh, this could be it right here. Angels wings again. A second Angels wings. Oh, but Sean's still alive. Oh my God, Sean is still alive. A second kick out of Angel wings from Sean. Christopher Daniels high risk. Oh man, alive, he missed me. Went ass first on the floor. Sean still is stunned out here on the floor. Oh, Daniels throws Sean on the floor here. Oh, man. Running neck snap on the floor. These two men just are just burning down the house tonight. This has been a fantastic match. Back suplex right on the floor by Daniels. Sean thought he had this thing completely won and done with that elbow from the top rope, that jump cut, but a Chris for Daniels with the resiliency. Oh, Daniels from behind. Daniels 
Nice takedown from Christopher Daniels. Daniels could be setting up for a win. All he has to do, I believe, is hit the Angel Wings again for a third time, and this is over. Oh, what a proto bomb. Cover. Got it. Christopher Daniels has defeated Sean in an absolute war. An absolute brawl. What a match, and what a win for Christopher Daniels. He becomes the first ever hardcore champion. But he had to completely just win it from using all of his heart, from using every part of his body, to even using the backup fuel in the tank to beat Sean. Sean, I gotta say, you cannot put your head down from that loss. Sean put up a hell of a fight. It's just Christopher Daniels' experience probably got the uh, best of Sean tonight, but knowing that match, Sean will probably get the first title rematch for that one. He put up a great fight. So kudos to both, man. That was a hell of a match. Main event of the evening. Corey Crichton challenges Art the Clan for the world title. Corey Crichton won a six-man ladder match to get the shot against Art the Clown. Leatherface was has been complaining lately for a chance at this match, but we didn't feel like getting it to him. We're just going to give a bad stage for a twitch second to Corey Crichton. Clark Kenny or bad stage. We got Corey Crichton here with me. Corey, you got a hell of a week here. You have tonight, you're trying to win the world title from Art the Clown. Then Thursday night, you're facing Marcus Caden for the SWW World Championship. And then Friday, or the second part of Wasteland, you're facing Marcus for the MSW uh, for your championship, Corey. And so, tonight, Corey, what are you thinking about? Well, Clark, I'm going to say this. As much as I cannot wait to face Marcus in those two matches, tonight is something that means a lot as well. This is another chance to prove why I'm one of the greatest wrestlers alive. This is another reason to prove why I'm one of the greatest of all time. If I can win another world championship in a different company, this will even claim my state further on the ladder of the ranks of the greatest wrestlers of all time. And I'm not just doing this for myself. I'm doing this for my wife. I'm doing this for all of the Boomtown Saints. I'm doing this for all the fans of Shockwave and MSW. But most importantly, I'm doing this for Wolfchild. I'm going to win this world championship for Wolfchild tonight. Well, there you go. Great statement by Corey Crane. Is he saying he's, he's most likely, he wants to mostly win this title for Wolfchild? As if you do watch MSW, you know the troubles that Art the Clown and Wolfchild have. Very real. Main event of the evening here in Japan. It's been an absolute great show in Japan. Those last three matches were amazingly great. And of course, the last match so far is match of the evening between Corey and, I mean, Corey, between Sean and Christopher Daniels. Here's Corey Crichton, trying to win another world championship in a different company. But he's facing a very unpredictable man and a very hard one to beat, Nart Clown. Here we go. World title main event here. Corey versus Art. Corey Crichton and Brett McLaughlin had an absolute classic match last episode where Corey just barely got beat by Rhett McLaughlin. It took three spine busters to put down Corey. Well, no, it took more than just three spine busters to put Corey down. Oh, what a shock, right to the head of Corey Crichton. But uh, here comes Crichton, but Art and Crichton are going to do a lot of countering with each other here. Corey, springboard back elbow. Corey, as Art where he wants him, throws him in the corner, Corey. Oh, an elbow to the head of Corey Crichton by Art the Clown. But Corey fighting back. Hurt and Rana from Corey. Corey taunting, trying to get the fans on his side here. Corey Crichton from behind. Neckbreaker. Art just sat right up from that neckbreaker. You gotta be kidding me. And Corey's thrown to the floor. And well, here comes Art. 
Counter by Corey on the floor. Corey has to stay on Art tonight who wants to win that world championship. But Stone Street a lot to beat Art the Clown. Corey. Oh, we're in dropped it to the back for Art the Clown. And now this has been mostly all Corey Crichton. Can't DDT on the floor by Corey to the world champion. Oh, but Art is now fighting back in this. Back in the rain is Art the Clown. Corey's also going to follow suit. Corey with the drop kick. And Corey Crichton covers. Corey to win the world title. Kicked out of two by Art the Clown. Corey's waiting for Art to get up. Corey. Oh, but Art with a block. Art blocked it. Corey. Corey on the ropes by Art the Clown. Oh, an elbow by Corey. Blocked it. Corey. Double, underhook, power. Oh no, double on a backbreaker for Corey Crichton. Corey, double, game face buster for Corey Crichton. Crichton to win the world title. No, Art the Clown with the kick out. Oh, super kick for Crichton. Corey Crichton for the world title. This could be it. He got it. Corey Crichton. Has done it. Corey Crichton did the thing that he wanted to do tonight. And he has won the MOUW World Championship. He stayed on Art the whole match. Every time he like Art the Clown was trying to get momentum back, Corey took it away from him. And Corey Crichton can now say that he is a world champion. And a, and a different company once again. So what a win for Corey. And uh, Corey, I know you would probably, I know you could hear this, but I'm looking forward to this weekend, you and me, in two different matches. And I will say this, Corey, no matter what happens, man, it's gonna be great facing you, but I'm gonna make sure that the outcome of both of those is me walking out with a championship. I can't guarantee it, because knowing that you are so good, but I'm gonna make sure that I walk out of one of these matches with a championship. Ladies and gentlemen, that was a hell of a, an absolute great show here in Japan at the Tokyo Dome. Some fantastic matches, including the match of the evening definitely is Sean versus Christopher Daniels. That was an amazing match. We had also a couple of other great matches, and hopefully we'll see you for the next stream.